So again, same thing as last chapter, last session, just the choice is yours. And until today, you may not even been, by the time this session is done, things may come up that you did not realize. I want to encourage you that that is the growth that you are experiencing and do not spend, please, please, please do not spend a lot of time beating yourself up over it. Just for those of you who are spiritual, just ask God to teach you what you're supposed to learn from that experience and don't let the enemy use it for evil against you. I heard it said the other day that you are not responsible for the things you did not know, but once you know, then you're responsible. So, and I'm not trying to beat a dead horse, but just like we were talking last week about the get to and have to, once you realize that the have to is a poison that you are speaking, then you will learn to recognize it, but don't beat yourself up over it. And the same goes from being in stressful situations or in stressful relationships or work environments or whatever the case may be. You can still turn that into a blessing. And I will admit, sometimes it takes a little while to find that silver lining because sometimes we're just all in our own junk. I mean, we're human. We have lives to live. We do have other people in our lives who, whether we want to admit it or not, are going to affect us. I'm just asking you to not let them to affect you for a very long time. And once it's pointed out to you, once you recognize, oh, this is affecting me, then choose the positive side and leave the negativity behind. And it'll come with time. Once these, once we're completely finished with the sessions, you guys, you guys will have all the tools that you need so that no matter what's going on in your life at that time, you'll be able to see that silver lining. You'll be able to see the positive in any situation where you're going to rub off on people. And one day they're just going to go, what, where did that come from? And you can just sit back and smile, just sit back and smile and just watch them grow and encourage them on the way, on their journey as well. So it's growth for you personally, but quite honestly, you change the world one person at a time. So as we change ourselves and others around us see the change, they in two will make a change. <laughs>